carry. Uh, I think we can really, we can be really short when we would summarize the race. It was just really, really exciting. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good to hear. How will you summarize uh, your race or uh, the race? Yeah, well, I mean, I started and felt like pretty comfortable right away on all the the slippy bits, which is kind of like my mo. I come from a mountain bike background, so that kind of that suits me well. And then I was feeling good fitness-wise too, so it was, it was a good combination for me. And uh, yeah, uh, Steven, obviously, I knew I knew at the beginning of the race he was kind of holding back, and then he attacked, and I knew that that was what I needed to be with. So. I did that, and uh, then about midway through, Curtis started to come up to us, and I knew that if I let Curtis get on, then you know they were going to get me with some sort of team tactic, and I might have ended up third. So I said, you know what, like I'm just going to bury it halfway through, and and just plan on getting second. So that's kind of what happened. Steven, Steven just was more fit than me at the end, and I mean he played he played the game, so it's good. After two three laps, um, Steven had. <coughs> a little gap, but you came back. Did you ever thought you could win after you came back? You know, I like there is there's always that little like inkling of hope there, but at the same time, you know, like I'm not an idiot. I know how strong Steven's riding right now, and I knew that kind of like the only way I was gonna win was maybe uh, mechanical on his part. Um, so I was just happy to hang with him, and you know, sitting on a wheel like that and. You know, like powers and those guys uh, it's always just a learning experience so I was just happy to sit back there and second is still a great result yeah. but did you expect that really uh, you know so coming off of last weekend I got third and that was my first C1 podium and then I got fourth on the C2 day so you know I knew my form is there uh, and I'm starting to come around this year more so than last so uh, I kind of had that expectation um, the thing is though, this is the C2 day, and so I had to work pretty hard for that today, so we'll see what happens tomorrow. I'm kinda... But you are in good shape, and that will be useful tomorrow for the C1 event. Yes, for sure. I know Power sat out today, and Driscoll also, so there'll be some fresh legs tomorrow. Um, so maybe I play play the conservative role and, and watch wheels pretty early. You think it's possible to be on the podium again tomorrow? Yeah, for sure. I mean, like I said, I feel good right now, so I think it's just a matter of playing my cards right and not burning too many matches and, uh, you know, having something for the, the last couple laps. And a bit like a tactical race, I think. Yeah, I hope so. I mean, we'll see what we'll see what happens. I know it's not supposed to rain anymore, so maybe it tacks up a little bit and, um, you know, stays a little bit slippery. That'd be good. Okay, thank you very much. Thanks.